lot of people ask how the Rydale sorter works, and the quick answer is pretty good, but usually that's not good enough for them. They kind of are really interested in what it's doing. A lot of people make the assumption that it's using the weight of the coin, the difference in the weight of the coin between the copper and the zinc, but that's not the case. It's actually best compared to a metal detector. This is this device on here called the coin comparator actually has three coils in it. And those coils are sensing the metal content of the sample coin and the sample coin is affixed in the unit right behind and in another video I show how to change that out. Very simple. It's actually reading this, the metal content of that coin through its electromagnetic frequency I guess is the best way to describe it and then it compares the signal to all the moving coins. The feeder is pushing coins through down this chute 300 coins a minute or more and this device can read those coins that quickly and determine if it should accept or reject the coins. So the best way to describe this is a miniaturized metal detector or an alloy sorter it's, it's sensing the difference in the alloys. It is not weighing the coins. It is not actually touching the coin either um, or reading the resistance of the coin. It's actually sensing a disturbance in a field that's generated between these coils.